In the summer of 2022, Kate Middleton and Prince William moved into Adelaide Cottage on the Windsor Estate. A royal analyst claims that the pair has no desire to move into Windsor Castle. This summer, Kate Middleton, 41, and Prince William, 40, relocated their five children to Adelaide Cottage. The nearby Lambrook School is attended by Prince George, 9, Princess Charlotte, 7, and Prince Louis, 4. A royal specialist claims that the family is opposed to the idea of relocating to Windsor Castle, a nearby royal residence. The late Queen Elizabeth U and Prince Philip spent their last years at Windsor Castle. Today, royal correspondent Camilla Tomini made an appearance on This Morning with Holly Willoughby and Philip Schofield. There, she discussed royal properties and how they operate. She uttered, The Wales family prefers their modestly furnished Adelaide cottage over Windsor Castle, and they have no desire to relocate there, not in relation to us, but in relation to royal lodging. For Addiction Awareness Week last year, Kate Middleton made a film in the living room of Adelaide Cottage. Express.co.uk chatted with Deepa Metasagar, an interior designer and decorator who developed and manages Area Decor LLC in the UAE, to learn more about Adelaide Cottage's interiors. The traditional style and simple lines of Kate and William's sofa give it a regal appearance. With a touch of crimson and cozy flowery toss cushions, the entire room comes to life. It's official yet warm, and it's the ideal location for the pair to broadcast interviews. The expert went into more detail about the royal property's lengthy history on the Windsor estate. Metasagar stated, Adelaide Cottage is a historic building made up of the Adelaide Lodge and the Cottage, located in Windsor Great Park. The house has a brief history. In the 17th century, Adelaide Cottage served as a keeper's home. For his wife, Princess Adelaide of Saxe-Meiningen, William Ivy ordered that it be transformed into a vacation residence in the 19th century. The property's past is related to Prince William and Kate's rumored desire to provide their kids a typical upbringing. The cottage also exudes a sense of seclusion typical of suburbia. The original porch is still present on the estate. The well-kept gardens also seem to have kept their appearance for close to 200 years. Together with these additions, the outside now has a gravel driveway, a red brick outbuilding, and a gatehouse, a relatively unobtrusive security feature in keeping with the royal's desire for normalcy and solitude. The four-bedroom house is said to retain traditional furnishings, including the main bedroom's maritime theme, which was taken from a 19th-century royal boat. In this way, the decor is nearly iconic. The house apparently boasts a neutral color palette that includes royal blue, deep crimson, and subtle gold accents creating an air of elegance. An effect of calmness is produced, which is ideal for a household with young children. Smaller than the family's other two residences, the ancient residence exemplifies the intention to raise the children in a normal manner, while still making sure they are firmly anchored in royal heritage. As Sophie and Kate are close friends and Bagshot Park is not far away, perhaps the women value the close closeness.